How to Increase Your Download Speed with uTorrent by jbob.org. Now, uh, we've been getting a lot of emails in reference to um, increasing your download speed. So, basically, we're going to go through this tutorial and show you basically how to increase your download speed. Now, it also depends on your internet provider. You may have dial up, you may have high speed. Now, in reference to high speed, there's different types of high speed. Uh, you can have unlimited, you can have, um, I don't know, basic high speed. Basically, when you go talk to your service provider, you're going to want um, what's the best high speed in your area. Now, with that being said, the faster your high speed, the more expensive your bill is going to be. So it all depends how much you can afford. But we're going to also show you how to increase your download speed with uTorrent. So since you already have uTorrent on your PC or laptop, we're going to show you how to tweak your settings. First things you want to do is go to your options and you want to go to your setup guide. Now in your setup guide, this is very critical. Um, a lot of people don't pay attention to this, and if you're new to downloading, you're going to pretty much, pretty much, sorry, um, overlook this. So this is what you need to do: you go into your setup guide, and you got to make sure you have your bandwidth selected and your network. Now, since you have that, you're going to have to run a test, and here's the run test button. Now, in your bandwidth, you're going to want to select one of the choices that you have in your drop down menu and it's very important that you do every single one now I would get a pen and paper and basically okay write down USA New York number two so we'll select that I wrote that out on a piece of paper your current settings are at a limited unlimited sorry and your bandwidth is already selected uh, they're going to give you a current uh, port, random port, so just leave it as is and leave the check mark here and automatically port mapping. And you're going to want to run a test. Now, this test usually takes about a minute, probably 30 seconds, depending on your operating system. So just let it do its test. And on the right hand side here, you're going to see either two check marks or two X's or a check mark and an X or a check mark and an X there. So just uh, you'll basically see it here in a few seconds. Okay, now we are pretty lucky we got two check marks in both boxes. <clears throat> now, even though I got the two check marks, uh, since I wrote it down on a piece of paper, I'm going to say two green check marks. I'm going to also do uh, USA New York number one, all the way down to Sydney, Australia. Now, when you do all these tests, it's the ones you really want to pay close attention to is the ones with the two green check marks. That would mean that you got perfect connection. Now, in those two green check marks as well, you want to note your results for upload. This is kilobytes per second. So, right, and, and your download as well. So, this is very important. Now, out of all the ones that you chose to do the, the test, the one with the higher number is the one you're going to want to keep. So, say for example, USA New York number two is the top speed that I can get. I'm going to want to save and close this. Now, when you save it, uTorrent will keep this on hand. You don't have to make these changes anymore. So don't play around with it as soon as you get the two check green check marks and your download bitrate is a lot higher save it close it don't play with it anymore after you have that you're going to want to go to your options and then you want to go to preferences <clears throat> now when you go into preferences you want to make sure you select bandwidth now playing with these settings will not interfere with your uTorrent 
Now other settings may or may not, but try to stick with your bandwidth. So now since we're in bandwidth, we want to go to global upload rate limit. Now we got it set to 70. Um, I usually select zero, but sometimes it's not beneficial. It should select something like 500, 250. So we're going to select zero in this tutorial. Uh, global down rate limit, we got it at zero. Um, this is very important because that means your download rate will be unlimited. Um, you could change that to 250, 500. Sometimes it could make a difference. Like say for example, I have zero unlimited. So that might mean you know one million kilobytes per second. That's like outrageous, but I'm just using this as an example. Um, so when you're downloading, you may not get that. So if you change this probably to say 300, that may also increase your download speed even though zero is unlimited. But in this tutorial we're going to select zero. Um, so now we're going to go down to number of connections. Um, your number of connections is your seeds and your peers. The more seeds you have while you're downloading, the faster you will receive the torrent. Um, so if I were you, I would select an outrageous number, 400, 500. We're going to select 500. Um, as well, maximum number of connections per torrent. So right now there's one right there. That's one torrent. Some people will download five, six, seven torrents at a time. Now, out of that 500, your number of connections of peers per torrent is basically, you got to do the math. I'm going to say, say for example, you download one torrent at a time. All right, fine. We're going to use the whole 500 with that torrent. Now, if you're downloading two, 250, and so on. So, this is where you either want to or do not want to play with your settings but if I were you typical people download one to two torrents so we'll leave it at 250 number of upload slots per torrent that means uh, well basically it doesn't even matter that's for uploading purposes but everyone that downloads should upload so we're just gonna keep the number at five then we're going to hit apply and OK. This should increase your download speed. Thank you for listening to my tutorial and come to our website and please make a donation if you found this useful. Thank you.